Es ist. Es ist. Es ist. Okay. Ha. Ekranımızı da hemen bir tekrar verelim. Hello for everyone. Uh, wait. I, I I hear myself. I hear myself. <gülüyor> okay. Uh, I'm open my voice right now. Evet arkadaşlar şu anda karşımızda Insert Stonks'tan. Stan ve Şamak karşımızdalar. Insert Stonks nedir? En başta sizlere Insert Stonks ile alakalı bilgiler vereceğim. Şu anda karşımızda iki CEO duruyor. Bayağıdır da beklettik onlara. Yaklaşık 30 dakika, half hour gibi. Ee, birazcık önceydi bizim etkinliğimiz ama NFT Battle Miner yüzünden şu anda e, birazcık geciktirdik. Stan little bit angry for us right now. Yes. <gülüyor> Stan please don't do that. Arkadaşlar. Uh, sorry for delaying guys. Uh, really. And uh, firstly, I explain uh, something and I can show something for the community. Firstly, of course, we are doing a giveaway. <laughs> dur, dur. We, uh, we are doing giveaway on your Discord thing. Okay, everyone is going in the Discord right now. Arkadaşlar, 3 tane uh, çekiliş yapacağız. Insert Strong's whitelist ile alakalı, NFT ile alakalı. O yüzden bir buraya geliyoruz şimdi. Bir burada kendimizi gösterelim abi. Siten bize kızgın. Siten hafiften bize bir şey böyle. Şuradan önce bir sitene şöyle bir kalp alalım. Ondan sonra Prizerk'e de kalp alalım. Bu ikisi büyük bosslar. Şuradan bir kalp alalım. Bu kalp atanların hepsinin isimleri toplansın. Bu kalp atan kişiler e, yayın boyunca bu arada bunu paylaşsın bizim yetkililerimiz. Bu kalp atan kişiler arasından tabii ki çekilişi yapacağız. Fakat ekstra kimseye yapmayacağız. Şimdi gelelim Insert Stonks'a. Arkadaşlar Insert Stonks ile alakalı videomuz hazır. Yarın yüklenmiş olacak. Ee, tomorrow e, publish diyeceğiz biz videoyu. Tabii ki A'dan Z'ye oradan bilgilerini alabilirsiniz. Ama burası arkadaşlar Atomic Up gibi düşünebilirsiniz. Buralar gibi bir platform ve bu platform üzerinde siz bile isterseniz gidip oyununuzu sunup oyun e, ya adamlarla anlaşırsanız tabii ki oyununuzu buraya koyabilirsiniz. Burası Vax gibi düşünün, Atomic Up gibi düşünün ama daha çok e, community'sine değer veren kısım Neden değer veren kısım Kendileri de free to play oyunlar çıkarıyorlar Ve free to play bir şekilde Sizlere bir oyun değil şu anda olan oyun bu Bunu da zaten videoda göreceksiniz e, Fakat birçok oyun çıkarma planları var Ve STNX adında bir coinleri var Bunlar Solano blockchain üzerinde bir coin Stonk ekosisteminin içindeki STNX coin'i bu, e, barındırıyorlar White paper'da bunlarla alakalı zaten birçok bilgi verdim Phase 3 diye şu anda Phase 3'deyiz. Phase 1 ve Phase 2 geçmiş durumda. Karşımızdaki adamlar harbi sağlam adamlar. Bunlar bir oyun değil. Sadece bir oyun sahibi değil. Bu adamlar bir platform sahibi arkadaşlar. Zaten burada da gördüğünüz gibi sitem burada. Ee, şey okuyamadım ama şey şamak. Şamak da burada. Ee, şimdi onlarla Ask Me Anything etkinliğimizi yapacağız. Ve arkadaşlar 
Sorularınızı şimdiden hazırlayın. Okay. Welcome guys. Welcome to stream and welcome to Turkish community on Ecovers community. Uh, so we are delaying on the one month but we announce our partnership and I uh, give hints for the community but I am not explain everything and but today I want you platform for Ses ses ses. Şu an duyuyorsun. Lazım şu an. Sorry, this is a voice. Gelmiyor sesi. Gelmiyor mu? Yo mikrofona yakın. Okay, bir dakika mikro. Şu anda nasıl arkadaşlar sesim? Şu an iyi olması lazım. Okay, tamam. Uh, sorry guys. Okay. We can keep going. Okay, benimki gelir onlar konuşmuyor çünkü şu anda. Okay. Let's talk about the insert songs. Who are you guys? Shamak and Stan. Uh, what they doing on this platform? Not just a game. The big platform. So Kamak, you, uh, you start, I think. Okay. Hi, everyone. It's very good to meet a Turkish community, finally. We've already, I think, worked with one before. But, yeah, I love people from Turkey. So, peace out to Istanbul, especially. Uh, got a lot of friends there. Uh, so, I'm uh, Shamak, and I'm the CEO and uh, one of the founders of Insert Songs. I've been here since day zero. Uh, gave birth to the concept and uh, right now we are, we are becoming quite a big project with a rather large following and also really cool investors on board. So uh, my background is mostly in uh, multimedia. Uh, I've been for the last almost 20 years uh, producing feature films for cinema, uh, doing game design, sound design, music composition won multiple awards around the world and now i'm yeah head over here head over here with in insert song very big guy is here guys okay i explain them i translate them word to word you know we can uh, keep going like this arkadaşlar şamak karşımızda Şamak e, şu anda insert stonks'un e, CEO'su ve sıfırdan itibaren burada olan bir şamak Şamak daha öncesinde background'da arkadaşlar film sektöründe işte müzik sektöründe efendime söyleyeyim her sektöre el atmış bir adam fıldır fıldır evet baya yani şu an normal hayatta oturamayacağımız bir adam yani Şamak şu anda. Ee, çok sağlam altyapısı olan bir insan ve şu anda da insert stonk'u yönetenlerden birisi Şamak. Okey ee, Şamak. Yeah, yeah. Uh, community, <laughs> like your eyes and they telling now. Uh, yeah, hayır, hayır. Adam harbiden Şamak öyle arkadaşlar. Müzik sektörüdür bilmem nedir. Birazcık araştırırsanız görürsünüz adamı. Okay, Şamak. So you create the insert song with your team. And Stan, if you want it, you uh, explain yourself too, you know. Yeah, yeah, sure. I was just waiting for my turn. Yeah. Uh, I mean... Uh... I'm uh, also in the team as a co-founder. I'm working as a CFO. And my background is uh, finance and accounting and economics in general. I was working in investments and real estate, but I switched fully digital. So exactly into e-commerce and crypto. And I got totally sucked into crypto. <laughs> Me too, man. Me too. <laughs> On the Elon Musk FX. Yeah, yeah. Uh, obviously, uh, around three years ago, and uh, I started, you know, doing my investment models, some econometrics, etc. And I just fell in love with it, and that's why I landed. I ended up in here. I'm, I'm not a huge fan of uh, 
collectible NFTs, but when it comes to gaming and giving NFTs some utilities, I think that that's a huge opportunity for gaming. And yeah, we're building building something big, and I'm helping from the tokenomics perspective and yeah. perspective. I, I think you uh, handle everything and you find a Shamak. Shamak, I have uh, this project. <laughs> yeah, I take this vibe. Arkadaşlar stand'e e, tokenomics ile alakalı. İşte al, arkada yani Bitcoin zamanında iyice yere batanlardan birisi o da bizler gibi. Ben de o Elon Musk zamanında ne çöktük ya hayatımız kaydı. Sesler az gelebilir yine diyorum arkadaşlar. Ben sizlere çeviriyorum. Kusura bakmayın burası Zoom o yüzden. E, Şamak da onlardan birisi ve kendi dizaynını oluşturmuş. Ardından Insert Stonks'u kurmaya karar vermiş. Zaten bu şimdi ben de söyledim Insert Stonks'un bence böyle bir beyni Şama, şey e, Sten ardından Şamak'a gitmiş. E, Şamak gel bak sen de çok e, güzel bir abimizsin demiş. E, gel demiş bu işi yapalım demiş gibi duruyor. E, Okey Sten. Şamak da ayrıca Türk komünitesini çok seviyormuş. Daha önce bir etkinlik yapmışlar. E, you do... E, Ask me anything on uh, Richie's channel, right? I see, mm -hmm. I yeah. see on there, and yeah I, yeah, I was going to say that uh, the the other Turkish community we're working yeah. with is, is the Richie Land. Ya yeah. ee, daha önceden işte Richie ile zaten Ask Me Anything yapmışlar. Şamak da diyor benim diyor İstanbul'da arkadaşlarım da var diyor. Ben Türkleri çok seviyorum diyor. Şamak var ya. Şamak tam reis yani. Okay guys, so let's uh, talk about insert stonks. Firstly, I see your uh, website and these things you know i thinking about the pixel art like uh, you know but i'm going in and the uh, new projects not just the road road new project is came to you and every community on turkish community or french community on spanish community everyone came to you uh, one game you know they wanted and uh, ask you to hey this is my game and they get in your uh, platform or things how is going this thing so maybe let me give you a brief overview of what exactly insert stonks is mm -hmm. and this way you'll be able to perhaps you know shed some light to your community about what we do in general so insert stonks is what we like to call a web 3.0 game operating system it is a project that comprises itself of two parts mostly. Uh, first is the platform, the Insert Stonks platform. And that is a place where gamers and retail investors will get access to games, IGOs, exchanges, launches, news feeds, and all the such. You can imagine it a, a bit like yeah. Steam meets eToro or Steam meets Binance, for example, something like that. And the second part of the project is the Stonk engine. Yeah. And the Stonk engine is the underlying technology that allows any game developer to connect their game to multiple monetization methods. And it is no matter if it's a mobile game or a PC game, any game can be connected within hours and without blockchain coding. You will be able, thanks to the Stonk engine, you will be able to easily monetize your game, add NFTs or any other transferable assets. You will be able to build prize pools and arenas for your communities to have fun within games and compete with each other, add a wagering or betting module. And we most importantly, we are looking a lot in security as well. So we are building our own custom anti-cheat model. Uh, that will be working both in the in-game layer and on the transactional layer. So it will be detecting transactional fraud, fraudulent transactions that are happening within game as well. Uh, so we are coupling all that with a lot of uh, on-chain and off-chain data analysis that will be happening within the games that are connected to the ecosystem. Okay, thank you so much, Yamak. Uh, I I heard on your voice these things because you know everyone need to know these things not just the video thing because right now the CEO is me and CEO explain everything to community and I translate man arkadaşlar adam diyor ki hocam diyor herhangi birisi gelir diyor bizim içimize der ki bu benim oyunum mobil olsun PC olsun hiç fark etmez gelir diyor 
bizim içimize der ki bu oyunu benim platformumda yayınla. Ay sizin platformunuzda yayınlayın der diyor. Aynı Steam gibi ama Steam'in biraz daha blockchain tarzı. Herhangi bir kişi oyun yapıp onların yaptığı tabii ki engine'leri de var. Mr. Stonks, Stonks engine var. O engine'le beraber işte oyununu bağladığı zaman adam buraya gelip web 3.0'ı bize vaat eden büyük bir platform olmayı hedefliyorlar. Bakın şöyle e, yani küçük ben dedim ya size en başta bir oyun olarak görmeyin diye. Gerçekten adamların hedefi white paper'a zaten girin white paper bu kadar. White paper'ı okuyun zaten bu kadar. Ben özetleyebildiğim kadar özetledim sizlere white paper. Ama white paper bu kadar. Adam bunlarla alakalı gelirsin diyor. Coin'ini de kendin çıkarırsın. Price'ını da ama anti-chat sistemi bize ait diyor. Hem transaction'larda hem oyun içinde anti-chat support'unu kendileri insert stone kendileri yapıyor. Kendileri veriyor. Yani baktığınız zaman arka planda inanılmaz büyük inanılmaz büyük Yapı geliyor ve bu yapıya tabii ki de insanlar zamanla yavaş yavaş dahil olmak isteyeceklerdir. Belki de geleceğin e, Gable mıydı neydi o adamın adı her neyse geleceğin Gable ile oturduk şu an konuşuyoruz. O da Şamak yani. Okey Şamak. Uh, thank you so much uh, for a, information. Gable, Gable. Yeah. I, I uh, give them an example for a Gable. You know, this, uh, this guy is a Steam owner. CEO, and he is a... Uh, Doing a little things for the and going blow up to and I talk about insert stone like this thing. Yeah, really this. Not just a, a game. very good advocate. Yeah, yeah. Uh, abi kim bu oyun sahibi mi? Oyun sahibi değil arkadaşlar. Şu anda insert stones platformunun uh, sahibi evet aslında. Yosu ve co-founder yanımızda. Sen de co-founder Şamak bil. Adam sahibi yani. Zaten adamın hareketlerinden belli arkadaşlar. Ee, çekilişe katılmak için bu arada general chat'ine girip ikisine de kalp atıyorsunuz. İsimleriniz alınıyor arkadaşlar. Whitelist çekilişi yapacağız. Ee, okay. Right now uh, we can see the one game on the platform. Road to move. Right? And I'm talking about this game on the streams but I'm just showing the videos. And everyone want to carry about this the coins right you have an economy model for this coin this game is your own game right free to play game mm -hmm. so the game is our game we are building it ourselves and we are building it to showcase the possibilities of the stonk engine yeah and so we want to showcase our technology to the world with our game <sighs> And the game will be, of course, free to play for anyone. And only if you choose to take part in, for example, buying an NFT or investing in a, or investing in a wage, for example, when you want to race with someone, that is when the earn aspect comes in. So we are kind of changing the paradigm from, or maybe shifting the focus from play and earn, from play to earn, to play and earn. So that you first of all play and have fun. Second of all, you know you can you have the possibility to earn. But when it comes to the whole genius economy that was designed there, Stan designed the economy. I yeah. Designed the game. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I can show them a game one more time. Okay. And uh, we talk about the design thing and economy model with Stan. Okay. Arkadaşlar, şunu diyor. Biz diyor bir oyun yaptık. Evet bu oyun free to play. Tabii ki bu play and uh, play and play and earn. Tabii ki diyor bunlar sizin seçimini. Yani eğer istersen NFT alırsın çok fazla kazanç sağlayabilirsin. Ve diyor bu oyunu yapma nedenimiz teknolojimizi dünya çapında göstermek diyor. Yani biz bu oyunu yaptık ama bu bizim teknolojimiz Stonks Engine'in teknolojisi. Bunu görmeleri için insanların biz bu oyunu çıkarttık diyor. Zaten bugün vereceğimiz NFT'ler de bu oyunun içerisinde geçiyor. Ekonomi dizaynını Siten yapmış. Oyunu da Şamak dizaynlamış zaten. Şimdi oyunu bir görelim. E, ardından ben ekonomiyle alakalı Siten'e soracağım. Yani coinle alakalı nasıl bir dizaynda bu? Direkt mi yaptılar ne yaptılar? Oyunumuz bu arkadaşlar. Birçoğumuzun lise zamanında hatta Halil çok iyi bilir. Lise zamanında çok fazla oynadığımız bir oyun. Şöyle bir göstereyim. Bu yalnız bir tane birinci trailer'ı. Bir saniye. 
Ondan bir ben ikinci trailer'ını göstereyim. Umarım yüklemişlerdir bu arada. Okey. Şurada arkadaşlar. Şöyle bir bakalım. Bakın. Burada bir kardeşimiz bunu oynamış. Bunu ben de oynadım bu arada. Ben de size göstereceğim arkadaşlar bunu. Bir saniye. Ee, oyun içini, oyun içini, bir saniye oyun içi videosunu bulamadım. Ee, eğer ben açıp oynarsam, bir saniye, çok zaman alır bu bizim. Burada bir yerde oyun videoları vardı. Bu bizim küçükken oynadığımız arkadaşlar, bakın. Oynadığımız, hani vardı ya bu sağa kaç, sola kaç, Traffic Razor, aynen. Traffic Razor'ın ee, Play to Earn olanını düşünün. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We play on uh, the traffic racer is a uh, so hyped game on the Turkey for the five years. I don't know. We play on the high school. You know, everyone know this game. Yeah. So this is similar but better. <laughs> yeah. Arkadaşlar, of course better. This is the inside stonk. This is the stonk engine. You know, Shamak. Yeah, road to moon, man. What the, the traffic racer? Okay. Sit down. I wanted to share screen with playing the game. I don't play it right now. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, I think about it, but... I think it will lag. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think it, but uh, the video is came tomorrow and everyone see this. I'm just uh, curious about this stand. This is a coin thing. Uh, you know, yeah, we play this game, but uh, we uh, buy uh, some NFTs, right? And I want to uh, earn something on this game. You explain us the game economy model for from now, because the this is a first game on the insert stone, and this is a simple game. Everyone uh, play this game if they are buying NFTs, and everyone, I think, uh, handle this game. And what is the eagle eye? And what is the economy model? Okay, so uh, we are based on uh, one simple rule. Maybe I'll be saying that in part so you can explain. Or you want me to say everything and then you repeat that. How do you prefer? Yeah, okay, you, you uh, explain everything and I translate them. Okay. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, okay. So... The, the the one most important thing is that uh, the traffic in the game and the value will be created by the fun that will be in the game, right? So if the game is fun, there will be people playing it, and because there will be many options to you know play versus other players or bet on something or you know to earn money or lose money, the the circulation of the money will be growing and growing with the traffic. And there are two the most important pools that will be in the game. One pool is community pool, and the second pool is mining pool. So community pool will be supported with the revenue from that game generates for us, right? So we won't be putting tokens, like the plan is not to put any new tokens to the community pool, but 40% of all the revenue from all NFT sales, NFT level ups, all the fees, 40% will be going to the mining pool, uh, to the community pool. Wow. Everything. On the 40%, but every NFT sales and wow. Absolutely everything. Okay. And in order to be a participant in a community pool, you need to get a status of an active player, right? Because we are putting fun and gaming first so in order to be a, an active player you need to hit a benchmark of you know for example 10 races a day for seven days or something like this right and then you get a status of an active player and then you get a chance to get a chunk of a community pool and earn some first money to start you know betting against other players etc but it's not for free you need to be an active player in order to do it and now i can move to the mining pool But do you want to explain and then I... Yeah, okay, okay. I explain them. Arkadaşlar şimdi adamlar diyor ki oyunda her şey, bak her satıştan işte NFT satışı olsun, oyun içindeki işte alımlar, token alımı şu her şeyin yüzde kırkı, de kırkı community pool'a atılıyor. Kime diyor ki oyun bedava değil diyor ama bedava. Şimdi şöyle bedava. 
Oyunu örneğin arkadaşlar 7 gün boyunca günde 10 tane yarış yaptınız. Tabii ki diyor coin alarak bu coinlerle e, gidip bedava yani ben mesela fen diye karşı diyorum ki gel 50 sen koy 50 ben koyayım diye oynayarak kazanabilirsiniz diyor. Ama önemli olan community pool'a erişmek için arkadaşlar aktif player olmanız lazım. Nasıl aktif player olacaksınız? 10 gün boyunca işte veya işte 7 gün boyunca 10 kere günde reis yapacak. Yani reis de ne ki anasınız? Yaptın yaptın. Aynen gülüyorlar hoşuna gidiyor. Yaptın yaptın şimdi sağ sol sağ sol sağ sol yaptınız örnek veriyorum 10 tane. Aktif player oldun. Aktif player olduktan sonra para kazanmaya başlayabiliyorsunuz ve o community pool'a erişebiliyorsunuz. Artık tamamen e, kendinizi para kazanmış hale geçirebiliyorsunuz. Okay Stan. Let's talk about the mining pool. Yeah, so the mining pool <coughs> mining pool actually takes another 40 what are you I don't know to chat is talking about the shamak is going to uh, laughing. I don't know. I'm I'm using my hands and you know I'm exciting. Uh, ask me anything, Evans. I don't know. It just looks so awesome the way you, you know presented. I love the energy. That's why I'm so. Yeah. Happy. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Energy ne diyor çok sevdim. Hepsi böyle oluyor. Ben anlamıyorum ki benim karşıma. <gülüyor> okay. So it's that. Uh, yeah, the... so... So the other 40% uh, goes to the mining pool in a, yeah. in a shortcut. So uh, the mining pool, because, you know, normally in most of the games, it's just, you know, multi-layer pyramid of, you know, yeah. token going to zero eventually, right? And we want to avoid that. So we, at the beginning, because we need to generate somehow the traffic, right? We will support just a little bit a uh, community pool, or a mining pool with some tokens but you know some i don't know 200 300 dollars you know small amounts just to you know start the snowball effect right and after we will be able to sustain the community pool and the mining pool with the fees that are coming from our game then we are burning all the reserves of the token everything right i i mean th th there stays like a few percent for staking etc but We're burning everything in order to make sure for the players that there won't be any inflation, that we will be, you know, giving away like all the other games, giving away the tokens for just doing, you know, fucking nothing, literally. Like, you know, because the world doesn't work like this. Yeah, but what do you earn on this game? You know, the uh, 40% is a mining pool, 40% is a pool. And uh, just uh, right now I see the, you know, uh, Uh, 20% and we are marketing, you know, you choose uh, a marketing site for the game and 10%, I don't know, you earn just a 10% on this? No, oh, 20%, I mean, the most important thing is that the, the, the highest value is first that it's gonna, going to be a proof of concept showing our engine, this is a just side project, and the second thing is that this is going to be our flagship product for a long, long, long time. And we're based on this project, we'll also open the second part of the game later, right? So it needs to be sustainable. And it still will generate some revenue because the money will be still in the circulation, right? We are not, no, we are not, you know, giving it back in cash to people. We're giving it back to them in the game so they can still play and just, you know, pump the snowball effect even more. So important thing is that In order, you know, in order to get chunk of the community pool, you need to be, uh, you need to be an active player. In order to get a chunk of the mining pool, you need to have NFTs that you put oh, okay. in the garage, right? And you know, NFTs m are mining shields. And for example, yes, and <laughs> mining hopium. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And and for example, if there, are, it's like. Uh, because there is a pool that is uh, the steering all all of this, then you're not <coughs> you're not mining like if you mine for example 10 hopium, <laughs> you don't get 10 tokens. If okay. You, if you mine 10 hopium and for example at the same day, five other people, four, sorry four other people have also mined 10 hopium each. Everybody mines 50 hopium, right? So you get 10 out of 50, which is 20%. So you're getting 20% of the pool, right? Oh. 
and so so it always refers to the pool that is supported by the fees that are in the game so it all sums up to the situation where if we make the game fun and we make pve and different modes and you know different tracks and really really really fun then we will be able to support that economy forever basically as long as the game is really fun yeah arkadaşlar yeah. Yeah. Uh, i explain them okay yeah, yeah. Uh, i i miss it one one thing okay uh, but i i came here and i ask you arkadaşlar mining pool iki pool var oyunda ne dedik bir tane community poolumuz var bir tane de mining pool var. Bu mining pool'a erişebilmek için NFT sahibi olmanız gerekiyor. NFT aldığınız zaman mining pool'a erişebiliyorsunuz. Ama velakin e, mining shell dedi. Ben orada sıçtım kaldım zaten. Onu anlamadım ama anlatmaya çalıştı daha sonra. Ben onu size soracağım tekrar açıklayacağım. Şimdi agalar. Bu e, mining pool kısmındaki yüzde... Bu arada oyunun her şeyini satın alımlarının her şeyinin yüzde kırkı community pool'a giderken yüzde kırkı da şey gidiyor. Mining pool'a gidiyor. Bak Şamak oradan bana gülüyor hala. Neyse yüzde kırkı da mining pool'a gidiyor. Bu mining pool'daki token'lara erişmemizi sağlayacak şey de NFT oluyor. NFT'niz olmadan mining pool'u açamıyorsunuz. Garaj gibi düşünebilirsiniz. Şimdi günlük bu NFT ile belirli... Şimdi 5 insan üstünden örnek verdi. Onu soracağım ben ona. Mesela 10 tane çıkardığınız zaman yüzde yirmisi aynen. Yüzde yirmisi bize geçiyor. Ee, Sten. If I uh, if I uh, selling okay the ten coin, all right. Yes. Not just the five people. Uh, forget about the five people. I'm I'm okay one person. I'm buying NFTs and my garage. I'm I mining the ten coin. Okay. I take these coins just a twenty uh, percent, right? No, it's like. It, it refers to the pool. So, so imagine that at one day, all the people have mined 100 coins. Everyone, everyone is. Yeah, everyone yeah. has mined 100 coins. Okay, 100 coins. Yeah. All right. And you have mined seven coins. Okay. And for example, in the mining pool, there is like you know 350 game tokens. Then you have mined seven coins out of the whole hundred. It it means that you have at this day made your seven percent of the whole mining of every oh seven percent of the mining pool that is 350 dollars which is like i don't know 25 yeah yeah okay i understand right now arkadaşlar şimdi olay şöyle havuza göre değişiyoruz kime örnek veriyorum şimdi 10 kişi işte siten orada mineladı şamak mineladı şamak 50 tane mineladı ya siten 50 tane mineladı ben 7 tane mineladı Tamam mı? O öyle örnek verdi. Yüz üstünden verdi. Bak gülüyorlar bana. Ben günün sonunda oradan sadece yüzde yedilik alıyorum. Anladınız mı? Mesela yüz tane mainlanmış totalde ben aradan yedi tane mainlamışım. Ben yüzde yedilik kısmını alıyorum. Ne kadar aslında pool ne kadar artarsa veya sen günlük ne kadar aktif olarak mainlarsan o kadar fazla pooldan çekim yapabiliyorsun. Okay. I explained two way. Yeah. All right. So, uh, you focus on your community. Come against Stan. I I see that. I see that on the you know the uh, the pool things. This is important thing to me. And of course, the face to face meetings important to me. Because you know this is a trust things, and you guys up on click. So after uh, you talk about the Stan after the uh, Road to Moon game. Create one more, or I don't know. You create a new games on your platform. Yeah, everyone came to you like a city, but you create a new games on the Hearthstone. Yes, we are planning to. After we finish Road to Moon, and mark my words, what we are going to be releasing now at the end of June is early access, and early access will be, let's say. 10% of the final game, Road to Moon. So it's like a demo. Only a demo. Later, yeah. after Road to Moon becomes successful, we are looking to create the second part of the game where we build on the story more, called Mooniverse. 
Muyniverse. Muyniverse. <gülüyor> Muyniverse beyler dikkat edin. <gülüyor> Adam tam zengin var ya her an. Neyse. What is the Muyniverse? This will be revealed later. Yes. You know, we have to keep some suspicion, my friend. But already what we can tell, tell say to your community is that Road to Moon is going to be the first game. But we already are talking with 30 more games. Eh? 30? With, with 30 more games that want to connect to the ecosystem. That want to use our technology and that want to take part in the monetization, you know. Extravaganza bonanza. <laughs> Whoa, man. You you talk about the... You, the uh, that not a... Moon metaverse because if you do do 13 game on inter stones and find this i don't know binding them i don't know. is possible but it is not in our first agenda first and foremost we want to make sure that the games that connect are legit that their economies are right as well that there are no pumps and dumps and things like that that is why we have all the security measures in place for our platform and our project so the metaverse itself we are we will think about it of course and the mooniverse okay i can maybe tell you one little secret the mooniverse is going to be something like that where you will be able to connect between different games as well kamak kamak arkadaşlar diyor ki şimdi road to the moon uh, haziranın sonuna doğru full sürü ya yani demo sürüm ve karşımızda olacak Demo sürüm. Yüzde yani 10'u oyunun. Yüzde 10'luk bir şeklini görebileceğiz bu oyunun. Ama diyor. Bak diyor kardeşim. Biz diyor. Daha fazla oyun dayan ettik. Tabii ki e, Rotumun'dan sonra Rotumun'un ekstrası. Hani ekstra yan bir versiyonu çıkacak. Burada story mode falan ekleyecek. Ama bundan sonra Mooniverse diye. Yaracağız diyor. Bu Mooniverse muhtemelen ben sizi. Hani bunun olacak. Ama bu 30 oyunun artık 30 oyundan 5 yol olur aslında. Onları bağlayacak bir metaverse gibi. Metaverse'ten esin e, tarzında bir şey çıkaracaklar. Çok fazla bir şey söyleyemem sana diyor ama bir secret olsun. Bir, e, bir sır vereyim dedi. Hani metaverse gibi bir şey olacak dedi. Okay Şamak, if you ask me I uh, thinking like this, the metaverse are no the metaverse, the moonverse is Uh, in Star Stones games, finding themselves, I don't know, like this, but I. Okay. So, kısık konuşmuyorum la sizde. Uh, the road to moon is, but Stan is uh, going in our talking uh, before, but I think, uh, I know, there is about the Stan, what do you say about the, I don't know. The, another games the 13 you you you handle every economics for the 13 game and you say shamak no pump and dump it's not that stan handles all the economies the game creators are responsible for their economies but those economies are tested on a algorithmic model arkadaşlar pump veya dump olmayacak yani tabii ki bu oyun sahiplerinin kendi sorumluluğu ama bizim diyor fitlerimizden geçebilirlerse diyor pumpla dump o kadar olmayacak diyor ve e, stabil bir şekilde road to moon işte zaman ve başarılı olduğu zaman yeni oyunları çıkaracaklarını söylüyorlar bu iki kardeş mi yok değil canım e, they asking e, Şamak e, I have a this question a five time today you and Stan is brother no right yes, I'm his father <gülüyor> <gülüyor> babasıyım diyor da bak <gülüyor> Bak Stan, Stan sinirlenmedi. Ben bunu yapsam If I do this joke to my uh, Holovers and, uh, or another streamer They going to insult me right now <gülüyor> But Stan Yeah my father <gülüyor> Okay Tam bir uh, şamak var ya uh, One thing about the, uh, the, the The economy that we have been asking it on, Because I know it sounds It sounds you know Like a huge promise you know 30 games without pump and dump It's, it's a matter of educating developers because 
as, as long as you focus on a fun game, you can do whatever you want, right? You, yeah. You, you, can, you can do literally whatever you want as long as you don't, you know, dump the tokens that you own, right? Mm -hmm. So they just need to know that they need to focus on the fun on the game. No more clicker economies, no more investor versus investor. These need to be games playable, right? And and that's it. And we'll educate them because that's very important. And it really needs to change in the space. Yeah, so of course. Of course. And, you know, it's a matter of responsibility. If you want to publish a game on our platform, you are responsible for what you do. Of course. Shamak. Yeah, you have some... Like, you know, uh, the Shamak, like a Julius Caesar, man. I don't know. Uh, like this. And the, the boss. The boss, Stan. The boss. Okay. <gülüyor> Arkadaşlar diyor ki... E, bak, listanca NFT'sini alacaksınız da bu arada. Oraya geçelim. Arkadaşlar şunu diyorlar. Artık yani Stan diyor bu arada bunu. Artık diyor oyunlar investor the investor. Yani yatırımcıya karşı yatırımcı. Ponzi dediğimiz. Ponzi'den ve işte bu pump and dump'tan. Bunları uzak tutan gerçek anlamda oyunlar yapmak istiyorlar. Çünkü yayınlar inanılmaz geç. O kayıplanıyor. Ben anlamadım. Yani gerçekten inanılmaz bir düşünce. Ve şey de diyor ki Şamak da böyle yapıyor işte. Bunları biz söylüyoruz Şamak böyle yapıyor. Bu oyunları sahiplerin responsible. Bundan sorumlusunuz. Oyun sahi. Eğer buraya gelip oyununu veriyorsan oyundan sorumlusun yapıyor. Ee, Şamak. I'm take this vibe. Okay. If I, uh, if I doing a, you know, creating one game and gaming your uh, platform. Okay. My game going to down. I don't know. Like you, you like a, oh, this guy is dead. You know, uh, what are you doing? These guys, Yamak. I don't know. <laughs> no, you, you, you look, you, you must understand me. If you want to publish a game on Insert Sun, and if you, if you want to have a liquid economy. Yeah. UKYC. I need. You need to, because if the economy is to be liquid, the liquidity have, has to come from somewhere, correct? Yeah, of course. So you, KYC, as the game developer, as the game owner, before you publish, before you start doing certain, I know who you are. What the fuck? Meko. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Calm down. I, I, I translate this thing. Ee, soruları alacağım bu arada da adam şey diyor arkadaş. Şimdi diyor sen gelirsin. Likiden olur diyor. Sen vardır diyor. Zaten bu likide bir yerden geliyor. Eğer diyor sen bir şey yapacak olur. Ben seni. Batılacak. Ben diyor tanıyorum seni. Yani e, hiçbir şey olamaz. Sorular güvenlik, güvenlik açısından. Voice is game. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo, yo. Uh, sorry. One man. I'm going to. Okay. Si, si, sa, sa. Şu an nasıl arkadaşlar? Benim sesimden dolayı. Umarım. Ha, otomatik bip geçti herhalde. Umarım sadece yayında gidiyordur. Seste adamlar ayıp olmaz. Olmaz olmaz yok. Niye ayıp olsun? Adamlar içimizden oldu. Okay. Uh, Şamak. You are a trustable uh, guy. We uh, thinking on the Turkish community. And of course we playing your games. And you know. If every, anyone going to do anything for the liquidity. You know them. Yeah. You, you, you explain their identity for us. Please. Look. I have systems in place. Yeah. That are going to be monitoring such things. Uh -huh. Tokens are going to be locked up. You know, it's we are making this platform safe. As mm -hmm. I Safety is the priority, because people who come to play for fun, they do not need to read a whole economic textbook. To of course. Liquidity pools, work, pools work, etc. They need security. And this is something that we are looking at, that we are providing, and we are mm -hmm. very serious about it. Yeah, I I translate them. 
arkadaşlar diyor ki yani buraya geldikleri zaman diyor zaten bizim bir sistemimiz var diyor. İnsanlar eğlence için oyun oynuyor diyor. Gidip bütün o koca koca işte efendim mesela ekonomisidir bilmem nesidir bu white paperları işte okumalarına gerek yok insanlar oyun oynamak için benim platformuma gelsin diyorlar. Chatten bir şey aldım arkadaşlar bu adamlar öyle bir şey yapacak olsa bu yüzlerini göstermezler. We has a two question on the chat Şamak and one question uh, not a question this is a... Uh, It's one thing they doing on the NFT thing and uh, they uh, stole the liquidity and they run away uh, one another project or platform. I don't know, but I explain them. You are here and your identity is here. You who you are. You are Shamak and this is a stand. This is for everything on the crypto on the blockchain. You know, uh, I take the projects on the Mecoverse community. I'm doing a face to face meetings. Because of this, you know, if any any man is showing your uh, themselves on here or the streams or the community site or the website, this is a trusting, you know, because everyone know your identity and I trust you guys. Forget about this question, but we have a one uh, important question, Shamak. He asking you, the insert stone technology. Uh, please explain more than this uh, technology because he's asking these games every games how do they uh, add this technology every games and uh, wait I'm translated on the TV chat and on the discord uh, your discord channel developer and gamer roles you know what is the difference of these roles and the developers and the gamers uh, the in-game thing, you know, how to, uh, you know, touch in the game, the developers or gamer roles. He's uh, asking this. On the Discord itself? Yeah, yeah. When it comes on the Discord, it will be, it's, that is better to answer this question, I think. Mm -hmm. Or maybe even our community manager would be better to answer those things because they are mm -hmm. setting up the Discord. Mm -hmm. uh, when it comes to the technology itself, I will answer that part of the question. So... <clears throat> it's very simple, to be honest, connecting to the Stonk engine and utilizing the uh, monetization features. It's an API connection. It will be an SDK will be available for different game engines. Right now, it's an REST API technology. That's how we connect the road to moon. Bu. And Çok kolay diyorlar arkadaşlar. Sorry, Stan. I, I, uh, I take you. Yeah, translate and then I will... Mm -hmm. uh, You know, yeah, the Discord thing. Uh, Arkadaşlar çok kolay diyorlar. MPI, uh, MPI teknolojisiyle beraber uh, Stonks engine'i her, herhangi bir oyuna uh, entegre edebiliyoruz diyorlar. Simple, right? Every game. API. Yeah. API. API arkadaşlar. Artık ben bile bilmiyorum. This is a, you know, developer things. I don't know API, but I, uh, this guy, the question guy is no API, I think. If he's asking this, you know, he's no. Yeah. Yeah, he better know. Okay, Stan. Yeah, so when it comes to this Discord thing, mm -hmm. this is simply for us because, you know, depending on what role you take, there will be, you know, different reach out in your, in your site. I mean, if you are a game developer and you click that you're a game developer, we will mm -hmm. most likely, you know, contact you when we'll be doing some event for game developers, you know, to find somebody who is building a game and maybe you would like to use our techno technology, right? Because our technology in total that a developer can use, it's like, you know, it's saving around, I don't know, 300, 400 thousand dollars, right? So yeah. in, if the developer comes and want to connect get the game, we should know that there is a developer in our community and this is exactly for this. So if you're a developer, click that you're a developer. If you're a gamer, click that you're a gamer because we need to know that because we'll communicate you in a different event. Yeah. For different purposes. And that's it. This is it. Arkadaşlar yani bu gamerla developer muhabbetinde den yani oyun içine bir etki yok. Eğer diyor yani Discord'da gamersan gel diyor gamer'a tıkla. Eğer diyor bir oyun yapacaksan biz seninle bununla alakalı iletişime geçelim diyor. Developersan developerlığınla alakalı bir iletişime geçelim diyor. Hani bunu Discord'da basit bir şekilde yapabilirsiniz diyor. Oyun içi etkisi bunun tabii ki de e, yok ama şöyledir işte developer olarak aralarına girmek istiyorsan tabii ki etki edebilirsin veya bilemiyorum artık. E, bu developer iş işleri vesaire işleri beni aşıyor arkadaşlar. What does Stone... Uh, okay, thank you Stan. I explained them. Uh, Stone Engine do exactly. 
E, i̇şte bunu ben sana açıklayabilirim. E, demin çünkü e, yayının başında açıkladı. E, one more question for the chat. E, what does Stank Engine do exactly? E, you explain e, starting s- stream, right? This thing. If this thing I explain them or he's asking another thing, I don't know. You explain so them. Maybe go through it again. Yeah. Let's mention the Stunk engine is an API. So through that API, you will be able to connect your game to different monetization features. So you will be able to connect the game first and foremost to our hot wallet technology. So we have our own hot wallet designed to work with games. And this hot wallet will be very easy to implement. And through this module, you will be able to later add monetization features to your game. So, for example, you will be able to peg your in-game economy to different tokens. Mm-hmm. You will be able to add in-game items as NFTs, label them as NFTs. You will be able to build arenas like multiplayer API where people can meet and, you know, compete against each other. Maybe not in one game session per se. This will come in the future. But, for example, they will be able to set up pools, like hmm. the prize pools that Stan, men- that Stan mentioned before, and arenas as well. Apart from that, you have the anti-cheat measure. So the anti-cheat works on the in-game layer and also the transactional layer. Yeah. Uh, right now he's uh, writing on the chat. Oh, okay, I get it, and this is very good, man. Yeah, this is very good, man. He's uh, writing this. Uh, anladığım kadarıyla size anlatayım. Uh, Road to Moon ne zaman oynanabilir olacak? June, uh, Haziran'ın sonunda demosu çıkacak arkadaşlar. So small. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Şamak. <laughs> Şamak üç bir şakalar. Anladığım kadarıyla anlatayım diyeceğim. Bunu e, Tayko sen anlatsan daha tatlı olur yazarak. Vallahi hani MP, A, API teknolojisidir işte bilmem nedir ama ben anladığım kadarıyla size anlatayım. Senin bir oyunun varsa aga bu adamlara getiriyorsun işte hot wallet e, şekliyle. Bunlar otomatik bir şekilde e, bağlanıyorlar ve kendilerine bir şekilde uyarlıyorlar oyunu. Benim anladığım kadarıyla Tayko bunu e, anlasın daha iyi olur. Çünkü bu developer işlerinde ne kadar anlasak da işte bazı terimleri kaçırıyoruz. Kusura bakmayın Tayko yazsın. E, Okey. E, Şamak. Metamask gibi bir wallet yapıp oyuna entegre edeceklermiş. Ha hot wallet dedi o zaman. Okay, Tyco is uh, explaining the development things right now. The Turkish community, because you know, development things. I, I, I'm thinking about. Oh, what is this? What is this? And I miss it. But right now, he's explaining uh, the community these things. So, uh, arkadaşlar, şey var mı? Sorularınız var mı? Şamakla sitene. We can do uh, the ask me anything or uh, on the future play together uh, with you guys. I I I I really like it, and you know, uh, you came to stream like a uh, little angry to me because you are the right to you know the delaying thing. But right now everyone is going to be smiling, and if you, I'm asking the questions for the chat right now. They if they has a question for you, I quest for you. Oh, of course I ask you, but right now if you want to explain the giveaway. Uh, things you know they taking the white list for the NFTs, but what is the white list? You know they want to know what earnings. Okay, so uh, right now, as Shamek said, we're opening the early access in June. Yeah. So in order to be able to go to this early access, because in this early access you will be able to, you know, we win some things, help us build the game, give us feedback, right? So mm-hmm. in order to have access to this early access, you need to have a, a utility NFT of the game. Yeah. And right now we're opening, within a week or two, we're opening a NFT pre-sale and we'll start selling these NFTs. It's not a lot of NFTs because it's only 1800 NFTs for the whole game, right? And we will start selling it uh, like within one or two weeks. And 
in order to be able to buy the NFT, you can, of course, try and wait for the public. Mm -hmm. But you can, you know, make yourself 100% sure that you will buy at least one if you win a whitelist pass. And this whitelist pass is in the form of NFT that will send you if you win. So if if you win a whitelist pass NFT and we, you know, open NFT pre-sale and you log into an, our hot wallet, it will recognize that it's in your wallet and it will open the, you know, the mint for you. Okay. So what they have a chance to win are these NFT, these whitelist passes. Okay. Thank you. Arkadaşlar, Şamak Batman olması şoku. Ha Batman oldu şimdi. O orada bir şeyler yapıyor. Like a Batman. Şamak, what is this? <gülüyor> what are you doing, Şamak? I was playing Road to Moon. <gülüyor> <gülüyor> Road to Moon oynuyormuş. Arkadaşlar, bu whitelistle pre-sale'dan ee, mintleyebileceksiniz. Eğer bu whitelisti kazanırsanız 800 adet ee, NFT mintleyeceklerini söylüyorlar ve tabii ki de oyunun Jun yani Haziran'da oyunu açacaklar early olarak ve early oyuna girmek istiyorsanız arkadaşlar ne yapacaksınız? Whitelist lazım size. Peki whitelisti başka nasıl kazanabilirsiniz onu da soracağım. Ama whitelisti bugünlük bize 3 tane verdiklerine göre ne bileyim aga. Ee, birazcık şey. So Stan they uh, earn whitelist on our stream. Okay but just a, you know the three whitelist. How to they earn whitelist? Except the content creators. Uh, wait uh, I mean apart from having a chance today or what because i don't understand the question yeah so uh, right now we can do giveaway for a community we can give uh, wow. three whitelists you know except us except the content creators how to earn whitelist are they going to be active on your discord or they what yeah, they do yeah. it? exactly it's like we're doing a giveaways on every ama that we're doing mm -hmm. so it always works to come on the ama so you can find all the amas on the announcements channel and we are doing literally AMA almost every day mm -hmm. and uh, and there are literally at least five or seven or maybe more giveaways during every week you can win for a lot of things and a lot of random shit right? okay so okay if you're an active you, you, you, you have a big chance of winning one ya arkadaşlar buradan burası hariç white list almak için aktif olursanız alabilirsiniz diyor ama 4-5 tane diyor giveaway yapacağız diyor valla bak bu şamanın kafası güzel ha bana bakıyor benle uğraşıyor şamak ee, 4-5 tane e, çekiliş yapacaklarmış daha her ask me anything de arkadaşlar <gülüyor> niye gülüyorsunuz siz ben anlamıyorum ki <gülüyor> everyone going to smoke I don't know but Uh, the tired guys on here guys. Hişama gelsin. Okay. Uh, ben ne anlatıyordum? Unuttum anasını satayım. I forget the what I say. <gülüyor> I can repeat. Ha okay okay. White list. Okay. <gülüyor> uh, white list is amalarda dağıtıyorlarmış. Eski anything'lerde dağıtıyorlarmış arkadaşlar. Oralardan kazanabilirsiniz. Şeyde Discord üzerinde de aktif olursanız kazanabilirsiniz. Kaç parayı da NFT bir soralım. Okay. Stan, the whitelist uh, minters, okay, we talk like this. Uh, the same price on the public or uh, what is the price? And you can give us a trick for this. So I can send you. Uh, there is a pre-sale. Uh, board. Let okay. Me, let me just find it because. Soruyorum durum mini devil. Bakalım. Picture, I think it's an assistant pic. Pre-sale. Mm. Oh yeah, it is. Uh, your name is just Mechaverse. Yeah. This is me. So I'm tagging you. On the, on the insert song? Yeah, if you go on our channel. Okay, I'm getting in. And you open pre-sale. <coughs> evet, okay. I see the white listing on here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so it works like this. It's the same price for like 
there are four waves of the whole pre-sale. Yeah. First wave is 100, then 200, 500, and 1,000. And the price changes be between the waves. And you can get a premium a whitelist pass to the yeah. wave one, for example. Mm -hmm. And wave one has the cheapest price, the highest chance of the really, really, really rare NFTs, you know, mythical and legendary. Whoa. Yeah. That's the, that's the best one. And these whitelist passes are like almost over there is then there is wave wave two where you enter it costs one soul right mm -hmm. and then the chances of hitting high rarities are smaller but they're still pretty big right yeah and then you go to wave three and wave four right and in all of this way there are different percentages and different chances and there are like multiple ways to win the the white list passes and you can find all this information on this pre-sale channel. All right. Right now, uh, wave one. Uh, where is the wave one? I hope we cannot miss it. Okay. No, we cannot miss it. Right? No, no, no, no. It's it's it's it's. it's Oof. Open. Okay. Arkadaşlar, gördüğünüz gibi piyasa ortada. 100 tane mitlenecek. Ve common çıkma ihtimali yok. Common çıkma ihtimali 0. Uncommon çıkma ihtimalinden başlıyor. Wave 1. 0.5 Solano. Solano ne ya? Solana. Ee, ya mintleyebileceksiniz. Sonra 1 olacak. 1.5 olacak. 2 olacak. Ama buradaki asıl önemli şey. E, yani şey değil. Hadi diyelim 2'ye de mintlersin ama abi şuradaki yüzdeliklere bak. Yani bu yüzdelik kısımlarda bakın direkt Wave 1'da. Kamın çıkma ihtimali yok abi. Wave, sonuncu wave'de yüzde 58 kamın çıkma ihtimali var. Uh, so, if I get a whitelist, uh, I'm minting more one, not just one, you know. If I get a one, just one? Whoa. Yeah. One, one, one premium pass is one whitelist. It's man, come Two. on. It's like, there are projects that are minting. 27,000 NFTs and we are meeting yeah. 1,800. It's like 1,800. Yeah, 1,800. So mm. it's really not a lot. So in order to be sure that you can buy one, you need to have one whitelist pass for one NFT. Mm -hmm. But when, for example, when the you know people with whitelist passes, etc., buy like half or mm -hmm. yeah, I know, I know. Left, then we open to the public. Then you can try, yeah, I'm going to say about this because if uh, I'm going to get wave one, you know, I take four for them. You know, on the wave four is two Sol Solano. Okay, I I take four <laughs> for this, and of course the whales is came to your uh, you know platform and buy everything. This is a bad thing for the community, of course. Arkadaşlar sadece bir adet whitelist'te olan bir adet üretebiliyormuş. Yani bu whitelist çok önemli. So you uh, give me whitelist too, please. Uh, except the three whitelist. Okay. We are the partner. We are the long term partner. You give me the uh, whitelist, of course. And... <laughs> Yok aga, ne 60 kişiyiz. Uh, they telling uh, this right now. Uh, on the turkey time, you know, we are on the night and right now the 16 people is watching us. They are talking, uh, they asking, uh, okay, just give us a <laughs> 16 white list right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, this is a joke, man. Of course, know, this, know, is, this is that. Uh, okay, so let's do the giveaway, Shamak. Okay, we give three guys three uh, white lists right now we can took the names on sending cards you and stan shamak this is you right Prez pr pr prismic yeah prismic prismic shamak yeah okay okay i see him uh this shamak is a uh, young picture some young shamak i don't know no no no no i was born old Whoa, you you just like a, you know the uh, Hollywood uh, film star, but the films is like this. You know, you take your whiskey, mm, okay, like this. You know, the cowboy. <laughs> wow, man, you you you are a good. You you came to Antalya also. You look like you know the every summer going in the Antalya on the Turkey or 
you know the holidays and you are a big guy. I know Şamak. Arkadaşlar neyin neyin Türkçe anlamını öğreteyim? Söyleyeyim de bir. Şama da bir şey öğretmiş olalım arkadaşlar. No, you cannot choose it. Right now you can watch the stream. Every sending cards on the one list, you know. We can do this thing, uh, uh, you know, giveaway thing. Who is open my video right now? Time. <laughs> <laughs> YouTube video. <laughs> okay. Aga, aynen aynen bunu söyleyelim. Everyone is... Uh, yo yo küfür öğretilmez öyle olmaz. Everyone is uh, asking you to came to Antalya and the community came to uh, visit you because they uh, talking like uh, this man is handsome and some girls we took <laughs> on this <laughs> mess <laughs> on the Antalya. My wife is next to me. Oh, aldınız mı cevabı? Adam işte. <laughs> ya <laughs> ya adam işte. Aldınız mı? Karım öldürür beni diyor. Okay. Right now open Twitch channel Stan and we can do the giveaway. Bana isimleri yollayın agalar. İsimler kimde şu anda? The names is came to me and we are doing stream. Uh, we are doing giveaway on here. Uh, I cannot send you. Uh, please uh, stay on the giveaway time. Okay. You are going to sleep. I know Şamak but uh, five men please. Bak bak nasıl esniyor. Artık çekiyor çekiyor diye bir salsa da bizi gitsek diye ha, öyle bana kızarsa da. Yeah. What is uh, this vape? Ico. Wow, I have a vape. Where is my lan? Oğlum benim elektronik sigara yok olmuş. Okay, I have a vape but I don't find it right now. Okay, forget it. And I take the names right now. Okay, just the three people. Uh, taking whitelist. Arkadaşlar bunu kaçırmayın. Harbiden yatırım tavsiyesi değildir ama uh, one whitelist diyorum. Bir kişi. Hemen çekiyorum. Hiç bekletmeyeceğim adamları. Zınk. Ahmet. Ahmet hangi Ahmet bu? Hangi Ahmet bu? Ahmet hemen şu anda bana uh, ticket açıyorsun ve ismini yolluyorsun hocam. Ha, bu arada Ahmet sadece kazananların Ahmet Y'ye aynen herhalde sensindir. Ee, Discord isimleriyle beraber hashtaglerini, hashtaglerini alıp yollar mısın Apo kazananların? Bir tane daha çekiyorum. Hugors sevindim buna. Hugors kardeşim bizden birisi bizim komiteden birisi zıngıldatır. Şimdi hemen bir tane daha çekeceğim ama. Okay one more. Holaverse zav. Hadi bakayım. Okay uh, we have a. Four streamer on the Macoverse community, and right now one streamer is winning whitelist. Yeah. Okay. Hak cici falan değil hadi inlan adamın hakkıyla kazandılar. Okay. We has a three people right now. I cannot longest uh, give away. Normally I'm open music and uh, doing something because this thing is very uh, long. But right now, I can send you the winner's Discord address, right? Yes. Okay, I send you the winner's Discord. And thank you so much for everything, guys. Shamak and Stan. I'm really happy to meet you on this Emma. My uh, funniest Emma. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't remember on uh, like this Emma, you know. I like you guys. I like the vibe. And... Thank you so much for everything. You say about the, anything on the Turkish community or Macovers community? Well, thank you for having us first and foremost. It was a pleasure to be here. And yes, actually I also had a lot of fun. So I hope we meet again on yeah. our server as well so that you can speak about Macovers to our community too. Thank you. A lot of fun. Uh, and yes, so I hope to see you guys all playing Road to Moon in early access once it launches at the end of June. And until then, if you have any questions, there is a Turkish channel on our Discord. You can go there and speak to people. Or also you can, you know, just write in the general chat, tag any team member and mm -hmm. we will answer. Thank you, Shamak. And I suggest you one thing uh, on the stream. Uh, also, where are you from? They asking this. Poland. Poland. Poland. Stan, you too? 
Okay. Arkadaşlar Polonyalılar. Uh, Shamak, you do like this event because the Discord activity, you know, because you communicate with community or your mods. You do like this thing, you know, the whitelist for the end of the June, right? You uh, preparing the em demo and you do like this level thing for the Discord and everyone keeps, uh, you know, speaking about the game on your Discord if they go in to you know 13 level this is a very hard thing also see 10 of this they are going to 13 level yeah they got the white list or i don't know if you uh, want to do this this is suggest for a friend and fr suggest from a partner so Stan, you tell anything for the makeovers community and turkish community guys it, it, it was so much fun last last last time i i spoke with rich land I yeah get as well so many hearts on the turkish channel you, you mm -hmm. have to talk and, and we had fun we had fun as well but definitely come on the channel you have my word that there is really high chance of winning the whitelist if you're active and exactly thing that you are you are, you mentioned about giving for hitting high mm -hmm. levels we are doing this and we are surprising people with this kind of giveaway so yeah it was a lot of fun it's one of my you know top amas I, I really <laughs> yeah I, I, you know, I we have always like this chilled atmosphere because we are just who we really are and, and that's it Yeah, thank you so much. I translate. Arkadaşlar adamlar diyor ki yani beni övüyorlar birazcık. I'm the best. Ask me anything. Uh, streamer. Okay. Okay guys. They uh, talking about this and whitelist arkadaşlar. Whitelist almak için aktif olun yeter diyor. Yani siz aktif olun ben size veririm diyor. Bak Şamak nasıl gülüyor. Şamak'ın yüzü gülüyor. Ee, aktif olun yeter diyor. Şamak da aynı şekilde. Çok diyor eğlendim diyor. Benim top AMA'lerimden biriydi diyor. Uh, guys, I hope we doing on uh, the future like a most funniest uh, days, you know. After 10 day, uh, I have an engagement party and I'm little uh, stress, you know. Uh, the everything is very hard on the Turkey, of course. Uh, and you know, I'm stress on the stress right now and I delaying so many things about insert stones too sorry for this firstly on the community side and your side sorry for this sorry for delaying but the engagement is shamak no me shamak understand me right now and after the you know the opening the game and we are relaxing and we are so much happy Our ask me anything or play together is most funny and most fun of the community side and your side. And I'm glad I'm glad to meet you. And firstly, I spoke with you, Shamak and Stan. Thank you so much. I cannot expect like these guys. These guys is whoa, like us, like gamers. You know, you know the you know the smiling guys. This is most uh, important thing to me. My best ask me anything. The inside stonk. Thank you so much for everything and see you guys. Thank you. Thank you, bye. Whew. Bak bak Şama, bak Şamak, sen var ya sen. Came to Turkey. Came, came, Şamak. Oh, I will come for my vacation. I just don't know where. Maybe Izmir. Izmir. Mm -hmm. Izmir is a good location, but you need to go Kemer. Antalya. Antalya, I, I write you, okay? I suggest you something. Inna, you know Inna? No. The pitbull Inna. Sun is up. Oh. Oh, sun is up. You know this girl? Shamak, wow. I send you. No, no, no. Stay, stay. I, I share my screen for you. You know this girl, of course. Wait. This girl. You don't know this? No, I don't. Whoa! Everyone know this girl. This is a uh, you're on the music sector also. The pit a classical musician. Whoa! Okay, okay, sorry. This girl is going to Kemer every every year. You know he has a home. I uh, she has a home on here, and every uh, one wants the vacation on the Kemer or Antalya. You know. <laughs> okay.
<laughs> Thank you so much for everything again, Shamak. It was great to speak to you too. Yeah. Everyone. See ya. Ciao. Oy agalar. Adam kültürlü doğru bizim gibi mi la? Herif bizim gibi mi? Şimdi ben size kendimi nasıl göstereceğim onu bile düşünüyorum. Hadi şöyle açayım. Çok yorulduk bugün ya. Ee, yayını kapat aç yapacağım. Şu NFT Battle Miners çekilişini yapalım. Ondan sonra e, ben de bir salayım arkadaşlar. Şu tipe bakla. Şu tipime bir bakın. Yoruldum ya. Çok yoruldum arkadaşlar. Yayını bir kapat aç yapıyorum. Bekleyin. <gülüyor>